what Mercedes just did with the all solid state batteries may be the biggest thing or biggest change since Tesla started selling its first vehicle. I mean, who would have guessed that Mercedes would win the solid state race? You remember about solid state, we were talking more about Toyota, but the German automaker recently test drove the world's first electric vehicle powered by a solid state battery. To repeat, Mercedes is the first company in the history of cars to get a solid state battery into an electric vehicle and make it drive. Granted, the company isn't yet mass producing any all solid state batteries, I will call them ASSBs for short. One cannot overstate what a big deal this is, friends. This could be the biggest change in electric vehicles since a California based startup called Tesla announced that it would sell electric cars. Welcome back everyone. This is Armin Haryan from torquenews.com. Mercedes is a relatively late comer to the solid state industry, solid state battery industry. But instead of attempting to independently develop a solid state battery in-house, it partnered with a US-based company called Factorial Energy. In fact, in this channel, Torque News, I have had several reports about Factorial Energy's solid state batteries. In September 2024, Mercedes announced that it would road test its battery in a few months, quote unquote. Of course, it was easy to be skeptical, as we have heard a lot of news from that. Over the years, many companies have announced that they will have solid state batteries in production or on the road by various dates, only for those dates to pass by with no batteries. However, in February 2025, this year, just a few months ago, Mercedes debuted the EQS solid state concept car, driving it on a suitably picturesque truck. There is news about that. You can search and you can see that online. This is the first time a solid state battery has ever gone into a car. To be honest, we have seen a small Toyota vehicles driven solid state batteries, but we're not sure about that. Near the end of 2020, Toyota began announced some, announcing some tentatively promising result from its solid state project. At this point, others in the auto industry began to take solid state batteries more seriously after Toyota started speaking more about that and Toyota was leading the solid state race, but Toyota is now losing the race. Although Toyota had several years of lead time the, of solid state battery development, the rest of the auto industry eventually caught up with it. Today, Toyota's battery development seems to have almost stagnated. If you have heard anything about Toyota's solid state battery development, friends, uh, please let me know in the comment section below. So let's talk about that. Mercedes just proved that solid state batteries are possible. Up until now, solid state batteries had been restricted to testing laboratories. Given the sheer amount of money and resources that had gone into the solid state cause, it almost looked like solid state batteries for electric vehicles were impossible to drive for reasons that no one would admit to. All the promising laboratory tests like Volkswagen's lifespan trials, which I also covered the Torque News channel, seemed pointless in the absence of a working car. Mercedes may have only driven its concept car a few times around the track, but it just brought the electric vehicle industry forward by several years. Like I said, this may be the biggest change since Tesla started selling its first electric car. If, um, even if most people don't realize it, their biggest electric vehicle complaints all go back to the battery. When we asked uh, year, uh, some back time uh, our own readers why they don't want to own an electric vehicle, some of them cited things like short ranges, long charging times, and the cost of battery replacement. Solid state batteries are poised to make current generation batteries obsolete. I mean, I'm talking about making the current lithium ion batteries obsolete. However, it must be acknowledged that lithium ion batteries made electric vehicles viable. Of course, electric vehicles are almost as old as horseless carriages, but uh, before lithium ion batteries, electric vehicles, even late 20th century models like General Motors EV1, tended to have about the range of an IC car running on fumes. However, Automotive scientists were already looking for something better than lithium ion before the first lithium ion electric vehicles left the factory. Various possible technologies have been tried in laboratories, but Mercedes is the first company to get a truly next generation battery, solid state, all solid state battery 
onto the road. What do you think, friends? When do you think we will see more of solid state batteries coming on our roads and seeing lithium ion batteries going obsolete? Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below and visit us also at torquenews.com for more automotive news. God bless you, everyone. And I look forward to reading your comments and hearing your opinion about the viability of solid state batteries. Don't say it's not impossible because, you know, uh, 10 years, 15 years ago, uh, not many people believed uh, Tesla would be successful. Now they're successful with lithium ion batteries and a lot of electric vehicles. Uh, entire Scandinavia is basically driving on electric vehicles. I was in Norway, uh, just recently came back. I was surprised. I was surprised to see gas car, basically, roughly speaking, on the roads of Norway. But, you know, now we're looking forward to the all solid state batteries that can actually make cars with 600, 800 miles of range. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. I'll be interested to reading this. God bless you, everyone. See you soon in our next report.